14, 14, 12. Oh my god, please. <laughs> All right, quick fire snipe filters. Let's go. Before the actual filters start, I want to say there are certain players that you do want to be consistently checking just because there's not that many of them on the market and they are quite expensive. So Demarcus Cousins is one of them. He's looking at about 40k and obviously because you can just scroll to the end very quickly. Definitely recommend looking at him. Rajon Rondo is another one. He's about 20k. You can sometimes find him on a buy now, but lower than that. Definitely keep checking Rajon Rondo. My favorite one is Del Curry. The amount of snipes I've had of this guy for 3k is insane. Oh my god, please. <laughs> also, Kiki Vandewey and Dennis Rodman. They're both about 2,000 MT each, and you can often find them listed for 1,000. Like so. All right, now onto the actual filters. Finally! First one I recommend is the Ruby filter. It's just really solid filters. But some Rubies are about 5 to 5.5K. If you do manage to snipe a Dino, Dino is probably the most expensive Ruby in the Series 1 Volume 1. But yeah, Ruby filter, absolutely solid filter. It's where I got all my Del Curry snipes. Now, this filter is sort of switching minute by minute because Scotty Barnes is now 9K oh on the I was going to record this video, he was about 6k, so this filter is forever moving. But what I recommend is just set this to about 8.5k and snipe anything that pops up. Another filter that's moving is the diamond one. Rudy Gobert is now 34, 33k, so I'd set this to about 29k, or you could just hard scope Zach Levine. Let me know, guys, what level you are in my team. I'm curious. Of course, you do have the pink diamond one. You could just sit there and sit on Dominique, but just set this to point guard. I'll do Steph Curry, pink diamond, and then search. Hopefully, one pops up for you. If you guys want to see my first ever 2k23 pack, Opening, click on screen right now.